Do you guys know what I did to get in here? I tape Larry Lester's buns together. Yeah. You know him? Well, you know how hairy he is, right? When they pulled off the tape, most of his hair came off and some skin too. And the bizarre thing is, is that I did it for my old man. I tortured this poor kid because I wanted him to think I was cool. He's always going off about, you know, when he was in school and all the wild things he used to do. And I got the feeling that he was disappointed that I never cut loose on anyone, right? So I'm sitting in the locker room, taping up my knee and Larry's undressing a couple lockers down for me. It's kind of, kind of skinny. Weak. I start thinking about my father and his attitude about weakness. And the next thing I knew, I jumped on top of him, start wailing on him. And my friends just laughed, cheered me on. And afterwards, when I was sitting in Vernon's office, all I could think about was Larry's father. And Larry happened to go home and explain what happened to him. And the humiliation, the fucking humiliation he must have felt, it must have been unreal. I mean, how do you apologize for something like that? There's no way. It's all because of me and my old man. God, I fucking hate him. He's like, he's like this mindless machine I can't even relate to anymore. Andrew, you've got to be number one. I won't tolerate any losers in this family. Your intensity is for, is for, is for shit, you son of a bitch. You know, sometimes I wish my, my knee would give and I wouldn't be able to wrestle anymore. He could forget all about me.